Hello, I'm Josh Bloom. I'm an automation specialist with McNaughton McKay. Today I'm here to talk to you about the HMS Anybus Bolt. The Bolt comes configured out of the box with a default IP address of 192.168.0.99. We'll need to navigate to that address in an internet browser. You'll notice here the address information is on the home page. On the left hand side of the screen, you would select network settings. This is where you will be allowed to change the address to match the address of your automation network. In this case, we will use 192.168.1.48. We will also assign a default gateway to match that IP scheme. We'll need to save and reboot the bolt at this time. This process usually takes 30 seconds to a minute. Now that the bolt has refreshed, you'll notice that the IP address has been set. In the WLAN settings screen is where you will select the operating mode for the bolt. The bolt has two operating mode options. One is a client mode where the bolt can be used to put a wired device on a wireless network. The other mode is an access point mode, which allows the bolt to create a wireless connection to an existing network. In this case, we will select access point. I will assign bolt underscore demo for the network SSID. Next, we will assign a passkey. This has to be a minimum of eight characters. And now you will save and reboot the bolt. Again, this process can take a few seconds. You will see this communication error, that's normal. And the bolt will refresh. Now that the bolt has refreshed, you'll be brought back to the home screen where you can again review the settings for the IP address, the operating mode, and the SSID. At this time, I'm now gonna cut over to a screen that will show Rockwell Automation RS links to demonstrate that we are now able to see the devices on the automation network. Okay, now, we, now we're looking at a screenshot of RS links. This is live. And you'll notice that I have four devices that are showing up on this network. Here I'm demonstrating that you can actually view the properties of the device live. So at this time, I have a wireless bolt connected to a switch with four devices, and I'm viewing that using my computer over wireless. For additional questions or more videos like this, give us a call or visit our website.